Hey, this is Richard Walker coming to you from uh, Bushnell, <clears throat> the VA National Cemetery. I'm here with my little cuddle buddy, <clears throat> Shelby, <clears throat> and we are overseeing, overlooking uh, the cemetery. Well, our apartment is up on the hill there in the columbarium. <clears throat> I'm here to pay my respects to Judy's ashes, but I know she's not there. She's floating around up there somewhere with all the angels <clears throat> and all the saints. <laughs> anyway, uh, it is a beautiful, let's see, what is today? March 14th. It's um, in the low 70s. There's a bit of a breeze. There's only one other couple here, and I've uh, really enjoyed bringing Shelby here. I wanted to see if she had any instincts of where uh, Judy was, but she doesn't. She's uh, just as curious about everything. And there's probably not too many dogs that have come around here. So she has uh, only natural smells to smell. Anyway, we've had a good trip. We just came down from Tallahassee and we have another uh, another half hour to get home. So I just thought I'd record this little memory and uh, say how beautiful the world is. And uh, even, though, even though I'm extremely tired and uh, I had a good cry and I guess I guess I want to share the fact that my tears are for Judy not for myself because I'm still here I'm still alive I'm still kicking but Judy's missing out on what's going on here so um, I cry for her, which um, reduces some stress for me. And I thank you, Judy. So we'll see you up there somewhere sometime. Say goodbye, Shelby. Say goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Okay, folks, adios.